My name is Kimia Forani. The name of this paper is Design and Control of a Biomimetic Robotic Rat for Interactions with Laboratory Rats. Bio-inspired robotics provides tools for biologists to study animal behavior in test pets for the study and evaluation of biological algorithms for potential engineering applications. Experiments on animal behavior have also been pl playing a very important role in psychiatric medicine. In general, newly developed psychotropic drugs must be screened in experiments with animal models of mental disorder before they can be used in clinical practice. The biomimetic robotic rats may be of great help in solving these problems by taking advantage of their programmability and reconfigurability. First, rat behavior in detail has been analyzed using visible X-ray video images taken using a fluoroscopic unit to observe rearing, mounting, and body grooming actions. They assumed that three movable joints are required in the dorsal spin to ensure realistic imitation of the rearing, mounting, rotating, and body grooming actions. Three DOFs are configured in both the XZ plane and the XY plane. When considering the limitations of its movement, if a if a robot can perform the rearing action, then the mounting action will be physically feasible. The angle alpha r in the x z plane represents a degree of rearing, while the angle alpha b in the x y plane represents a degree of bending. Thus, the movement limits of alpha r and alpha b in both the counterclockwise and clockwise directions are used as the main references for joint design and actuator selection. Using the SOLIDWORKS simulation, we found that in the pitch direction simultaneous rotation of this single DOF theta P1 in the neck and two DOF theta P2 and theta P3 in the waist and the single DOF theta P4 in the hip allow good imitation of the rearing and mounting actions. In the yaw direction, the single DOF theta A1 in the neck and two DOF theta A2 and theta A3 in the waist, driven by the differential gears, driven by the servo motor, allow the robot to bend naturally in the same way as real rats. In the simulation environment, the rearing angle is found to be alpha r less than 80 degrees and the bending angle alpha b less than 130 degrees in two directions. Thus, these two parameters satisfy the required constraint. The robot is remotely controlled using an external PC that communicates with a microcontroller by wireless communication. Especially, the remote control exchanges data with the microcontroller via data packets that contain a robot such as information and control parameters, including the joints, angular velocity, and the wheel speed. These data are first processed by the microcontroller and are then used to drive all the motors of the robot. Performance evaluations confirm that the robot can mimic the rearing, remoting, and body grooming actions of the live mature rats. The experimental results from robot-rat interactions demonstrate that the locomotor activities of the rats increase significantly when the robot mounts them periodically, whereas the frequencies of the rearing and body grooming actions of the rats decrease. Thus, it's assumed that the robot makes the rats feel fear by performing the mounting action. The ability to mimic the mounting action also enables the robot to convey a more natural impression to the live rats during interactions.